welcome you to North Augusta, South Carolina for the 2023 EYBL Peach Jam. This is a 16 under game. It is strive for greatness and new heights lightning. And this is a big one because on the sidelines is LeBron James coaching his son, Bryce James, and strive for greatness this morning with his assistant coach, Ray John Rondo. Bryce James, this is where he specializes, his catch and shoot ability, and on the boards a little bit as well. Here's Bryce James from way downtown, a little bit off. LeBron, very happy with Bartlett. Talk about the all-time scoring leader coming back, coaching his kids, you have to love that. And every time he walks anywhere, it's standing room only. You are watching one of the greatest of all time coach his son, Bryce, and the rest of the Strive for Greatness 16 under team. That is LeBron James, the four-time champion, the four-time NBA Finals MVP, the four-time NBA MVP, the 19-time All-Star coaching on the sidelines. The whiteboard is out for Coach Braun as we welcome you back to Peach Jam. As Bryce James trying to make something happen, James short, offensive rebound, and that one goes for Brayden Burries. Here's Bryce James. Bryce James can't connect. Rebound to New Heights Lightning. Five turnovers for Strive for Greatness in quarter number one, and LeBron James coaching his son Bryce's team. 12 points for Burries in this first half. He's got interest from Kansas, Houston, Cal. Oh, wow. Oh, that is a beautiful move and finish for Lance Piper. Coach LeBron, you know what's crazy is you look at some of the decisions. You, you look at some of the decisions. They're trying to extend out some pressure to slow down the lightning, but Preston Fowler in the lightning have had their way. Bryce struggling to get going a little bit here early. Quality shooter. Elsie Harrington typically makes things a lot easier on him, so they're happy to have him back. Five seconds here for Piper. Dishing it downstairs. That's a rejection from behind, but a foul. With one second left, and Coach Brown, he thought that was a clean block. <laughs> bang, bang play at the rim. LeBron never been shy about letting the referees know. Coach LeBron James, yes. LeBron is on the sidelines leading his Strive for Greatness team. The 19-time NBA All-Star will be entering his 21st season in the association. Four-time NBA champion. Imagine this right now. Getting instructed by one of the greatest ever. And what I would imagine he's telling him is not put the ball on the floor and stay in a triple threat. Why? Because New Heights has been forcing turnovers and getting out and running. That's been the Achilles heel so far of this Strive for Greatness team. It's amazing the greatest player in the world is focusing on the smallest details when I'm in the easiest details. Don't dribble. See the floor. Head up. Don't put the ball on the floor unless you absolutely have to against a team that loves to get up in pressure. It's kept New Heights Lightning in the game up to over a very talented LeBron James led strive for greatness team. Great pass. Murray's extra pass. Bryce James can't connect. And the rebound of the Lightning, who have a seven point lead. They're unbeaten this week. Be nice to see that young man right there, Bryce James, get loose for a couple threes in the corner. New Heights has scouted them well. Know what he's there to do, and that's catch and shoot. That will count. Down to a seven point game. Dangerous pass. Sprentley pulled it down. Sprentley to the rim. Had that shot altered. Great defense by Strive for Greatness. Harrington altered it. Burries catches in. Brayton Burries is unconscious. He's got 25. Fowler cannot hit. Strive for Greatness with numbers. Burries has been is acting different. Transition, pull up threes, creating in the half court. Number one on 
on the bench. LeBron's got to be happy. The Lightning can't connect. Rebound to Murray. And once down, double digits, they could tie or take the lead. To the rim. Contact. And the foul. Jaden Alexander. And who ignited the break, John? Braden Burries coming down strong defensive glass and pushing the pace. Excellent outlet. You see LeBron box out, finish possessions. They're not all 6'9, 260 like my man LeBron is. But Coach Braun's in the building today. Drive and a score. That's a big bucket for Spratley. One minute to go. Furries all the way. Couldn't stick it. Cofield had a shot alter. What a great defensive play by Alexander. Spratley to the rim. This place is packed. Riverview Park Activity Center fills up with coaches from the college ranks, NBA teams, fans from the area. They embrace this event to the max. And Coach LeBron James, what has he drawn up for his team? He just singles a message to his son Bryce, wearing number five. Well, one more foul to give here for SVG. Lightning up by two. Murray! box is just a suggestion. Jeffrey inbounds and tapped. Overtime at Peach Jam. How about that last sequence of plays, John? Bryce Cofield able to attack the rim, gets fouled, knocks down two huge free throws with a little less than 10 seconds to play, and then Braden Burries with a big-time defensive play. Jeffrey driving, gliding, stop. by five Terrace Oglesby. They were down by 10 midway through the second half. Harrington kicks it, and James was on the line. He's going to take advantage of situations, and they're trying to get him loose by setting ball screens. Spratley gliding. What a shot. Connor Spratley cuts it down to a possession. Burries to the rack. He got rejected. Christian Jeffrey altered it. Here's Spratley in transition. Oh! They were trying to sub in some ball handling. LeBron is beside himself, obviously. And they will. 13 seconds on the shot clock. Harrington lost it. Scramble. Harrington got it back and hits it home. Shot clock is off. The clock just stopped. Spratley drives and scores it. Spratley with seven. Spratley's got to move. He goes to the rim, dishes it off. They hit it with two seconds to go. And the clock go. never stops. Get a two. Strive for greatness. Coming back from 10 down and winning 67 to 66. Coach Braun's team does it in comeback fashion. What a game. New Heights Lightning got off to a quick start, forced a lot of turnovers. What happened, John? LeBron. And strive for greatness. Go small. They defend. They start switching everything. And they started finishing possessions. And whenever they did that, it allowed them to get out in transition, creep up, get the lead back, 
And it was all spearheaded by Braden Burries, who ends up with 27 and 13. What an exciting basketball game. LeBron James and his Strive for Greatness team never quit. They were down by double digits. And they come back and win. Braden Burries with 27 points and 30.